everybody, it's Jean, and I'm back, and I've been working in my book, and I've done a couple things now in my Play Accidents May Happen book. <laughs> That's the, uh, this one. Accidents May Happen, Inspire Others, Making Magic of the Messes, and of course mine are always messes. But anyway, uh, that was one page I did. <laughs> I was inspired by the stay on top of your roof. <laughs> anyway, that made me laugh. And then I did this page. Uh, let's see if you can get back down a little bit farther. Or maybe up a little bit closer. Uh, just a page about textures. Everything has a texture, a different texture. Um, sandpaper and um, uh, just, just all kinds of different things. And that was kind of fun to play around with. But anyway, that's um, that's just a couple pages I've done um, <clears throat> in this book, and I probably should have grabbed one of the others. But anyway, today I'm going to make a postcard, and I've made a couple postcards, and um, actually it is was made after I made this video because I'm redoing the introduction. <laughs> And you'll see, you'll see this in the, in the video, but, um, I ended up making this one, uh, afterwards because I had all this leftover stuff. So anyway, so that's the one. And then, um, I'll go ahead and let you watch the video to see the first one I make. <laughs> I'm always a little bit backwards. <laughs> okay. Hang on while I switch over. Let's see. Um... I was going to gesso it, but I don't think I need to because I'm going to really mostly decoupage this postcard. And I have um, a few things. Um, I've picked up some, grabbed some stuff, uh, tissue, pink tissue, uh, some lace. This is my favorite. These little lace medallions, I love them. They're just, uh, they're just my favorite. Um, anyway, uh, I picked up that. And some scraps here. Some little hearts. Little lace. Some more scraps that kind of in you know, the purpley and pink. Uh, music sheet and... Um, a couple of larger, I'm thinking, I'm thinking either doing something this way or doing something this way or this way. I don't know. I don't know what, what, but I've kind of picked out a few things to kind of play with. And we'll see where it takes us. And the first thing I'm going to do is... No, I can't put the doily on first. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put some tissue paper on here. And what I do is I keep a... I put a little hole in this. And I just squeeze out what I need. <laughs> and, you know, I'm already, I'm already rethinking this. Just now, I'm just rethinking this. This is not going to cover anything up. Okay. That is not going to cover anything up. So, probably what I need to do first is cover it with with the, um, I'll cover it with music. Because I'm committed now and I'm not wanting to stop. And mess around with drying it and starting over. And then I would have to gesso and all that. 
I'm ready to play right now. Now, it's going to... Um, you know what I was going to bring out? I was going to bring a little credit card so that this wasn't too wrinkly. What I want to do is on this one to kind of keep it from being too wrinkly if it's all wet. I don't think that's going to work. But we'll see. We'll see. It's a postcard. It's not great art. And I need some more right here. So I will do it this way. Let's see. I'm going to do this without any rhyme or reason here. Now this is the, this is Mod Podge and it's the matte finish. But I swear, it comes out shiny. Doesn't seem like no matter what I, what I do, they always come out shiny. Okay. And I'm really kind of wanting to do all this around the edges. And we'll see how that how that plays out. I have a million things to say earlier, and now I can't think of a thing that I want to say. I just want to play. And this is the reason why I think a lot of times I really don't run and get the camera when I'm working. Because I sit down, I'm going to just be here a minute. I'm just going to be a minute. And then, and I think, oh, I should have, I should have turned the camera on, but I'm already in the middle of something. Because I stayed longer than I planned. One thing about this, with the Mod Podge, it's going to be really sealed well. That's one thing I love about Mod Podge, is it seals it really good. Okay, um, now I don't like edges that are really really too too um, straight well and I don't like edges with all that white either so oh let's see let me put some of this pink under this because that's going to show the music right through it I love tissue tissue is my favorite thing This is why I don't sell anything because I know it isn't done correctly. The finished product is usually fine, I think, but I wouldn't think anybody would want to pay for anything that I have produced. More Mod Podge. 
now I'm probably getting my arm across in there. I like how that looks. I'm liking that so far. And I'll just put some some on here like that. Kind of casual, a little careless. Just a little careless. Then tear some of that white off. Put some over here. Get rid of some of those straight edges. Um, let's see. So I had goulash for dinner, and oh, I found a box of Russell Stover's candy from Christmas and I opened that today that was that was pretty good except it had a little bit of a chocolate bloom on it and I checked and it said you could sell it until May so I don't think it's supposed to have any chocolate bloom on it But it did. Okay. There, I like that. You know, I don't think that we need to keep hearts just for Valentine's Day. I absolutely love these hearts. And I didn't use them too much. I did use them here and there, but I didn't use them as much as I would have because I kept thinking, oh, I need to use these on Valentine's Day. And then when Valentine's Day came around, I, I wasn't hardly doing anything because I couldn't do anything art artsy. Okay, well, I'm kind of having fun with that. I'm already thinking I'm not wanting to use those big pieces now. I'm thinking I'm definitely going to, I'm going to cut, this has like a little section you can cut. I'm not going to use the first one because it's got some green on it. There. I've got a whole lot of these. I may make more than one. Yeah, that's my little beep. Do you hear that? Beep! Well, it's been doing that for months. Every 15 minutes, it beeps because the battery is going dead. I think I just want two hearts. Okay. I think I'm going to use the small I know exactly where the edge is. 
This is why my scissors are always gummy. There. Now I know exactly where the edge is. Oh. Okay. Got the Mod Podge on my little stickers. down just uh, no nope. was on there good does not want to pull down want to get it right on the bottom there there okay I have this great little book. It's just full of romantic little illustrations that I bought at the thrift store. And I've used it for so many things. Oh, that might be kind of cute there. And this is out of the, all three of these Baker pieces were out of this book. Probably should have put that underneath. I wonder if I can still lift it up. Just the messiest painter ever. I'm not even a painter. I mean, messiest crafter ever. I hate to stop and clean as I go. I was thinking about cutting this off anyway. There. That hides. that and that hides that and I've got this over here and I think I'll tear this I 
don't like to square things off. And I feel like that's what I'm doing too much, but I actually do want it square on there. I want that square. And then maybe a little more. Can't even tell what I'm doing here. I don't like this this light that I have. It glares on there. Okay, now I can kind of see more what you're seeing. get that down really good and then I have, it looks like I have a hole or something right here so that's a good spot oh I know what I can do well no if it's a postcard I don't want to put a button on it I had a cute purple button, which might have been very cute there, but you can't, you can't send a postcard through the mail with a button. I don't think. So, let me look. Let me look and see where I'm at on the back here. Okay, I definitely have room to trim that. Press that down nice and flat. and dry this and I will be right back okay I'm back and while I was over there I spotted this and I thought that's just what I need but I wonder if I want it to soften that that's so white I think I want to soften that color and how could I do it with what I have here at the desk? I could soften it with this. But would that be then bright enough to use as a sentiment? I think it's then it'd be too I love that okay but I definitely want it I want it softer I will be ooh now I don't know because it's stamped and it was given to me I don't know if it'll if it'll take anything over the top of it um, it's exactly what I what I want for it though I'm gonna go try it if I ruin it, I ruin it. 
But I'm going to use the Distress Ink Vintage Photo, but just light. Just lightly. Now that seems to be working okay. That looks a little bit better. But, definitely the edges. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Okay. I win. I'm happy. I like that. Now, the big trick here to Mod Podge. Put it right there, I guess. You know, there are people who absolutely will not show you their procedure and I'm beginning to realize why because now I just see that some of my edging came off there <gasps> oh no this the Mod Podge did it okay that's all I'm gonna put on there and let's see yeah, I should have just, um, I should have just put it underneath, not on top. I knew it was stamped. But, that's okay. That's okay. Ah! Boo -hoo -hoo. Okay, well, I'm going to go dry it, and then let's see what happens. Okay, I'm back. Now, first of all, I'm going to trim all the edges to see what we have. off all this and I have some little little sentiments that I can put there and What else should what I put on there? True. Pansies are true. And um, smitten, maybe. No, a charmed life. I like that. Okay, and that's my little Victorian one, and I 
probably should put a little um, I know I've got my black pen around here and just a little bit Then I think what we'll do is we'll get 
some more of this ink. There we go. And that is the finished card. You can see that. Ah. There were a couple of hairy moments there where I wasn't sure I was going to be happy with it. And we will see, I think I'm going to do another one and I'll see how I like that. Okay, thanks for watching. <laughs> I, I know I'm just crazy, but um, uh, I'm just silent today. I, I didn't have anything to say. I was just like, uh, what is happening in my life? And anything I was have been thinking about, I don't really want to talk about. So, <laughs> I, so I've, I, to me, I'm much more relaxed when I work in silence. And that's, that's what I want to do. I just, I just want to, I just want to enjoy the process and not feel like I have to have conversation. And truly, if you think about it, a real friend can be silent with her friends. And we can all just enjoy the process and we don't have to chatter all the way through it. Right? <laughs> well, we'll see how it turns out. So anyway, so that's... That's one, and um, um, I don't know if anybody would want to get that for a, for a postcard and get that in the mail. But the good thing about a postcard is you don't have to keep them. Okay, I'm I'm uh, I'm done. <laughs> I'm positive for sure, absolutely, I'm done. So now I have all this stuff to make another. Uh, to make another card with and so I think that's what I'll I'll do. Okay. Thanks for watching everybody. I really appreciate you. It's probably not even turned on. Oh yes it is. Okay, good. Bye-bye.